Good morning guys, good morning and welcome to another vlog in Ling Ling Life. This is the second day of the press trip with Sea Trip and Juicy Trip and I'm very very excited. Of course, I overslept half an hour so I've been rushing around and I still feel like pfft, I just woke up. <laughs> Um, the view here is so beautiful, but I don't have time to enjoy it because I should go and get some breakfast because because we're gonna leave uh, very soon. And uh, yeah, come along. Wow, the weather outside is just beautiful today. Gorgeous. The sun is still on its way up. Wow, this is a worthy breakfast, I would say. So we just uh, drove to the place where we're going to have the welcoming ceremony and yes I'm walking backwards because the sun is from the back. <laughs> I'm just going to show you guys, it's so pretty here. Just arrived inside, I found my name. They're setting up for the ceremony to begin. Just had a Tai Chi class uh, with uh, one of the Tai Chi masters here and now we're going for a massage. Very excited about that. And where we are right now, it's just here with the mountains in the back. It's so beautiful. So we're just setting up so we can get ready for a massage here. It's very comfortable here, uh, but there's also a very big uh, TV camera here. So I don't know how comfortable I am about it, but we'll see. So we just had a very nice massage and uh, my I massage Ai, she was really nice talking, talking, talking because I said that I spoke Chinese but of course I didn't learn any vocabulary about Chinese medicine and massage. So she gave me a long speech about how my stomach was working and all these different things and I was just like, oh yeah, of course, yeah, mm, I get it, not. <laughs> and, um, and then I was telling her that I was kind of sore because I've been running the stairs in the metro for a while. Um, but because the word for running and the word for to fuck somebody is very similar so I said the wrong word so instead of saying oh yeah I'm very sore because I was running <laughs> I said oh yeah I'm very sore because it's fucking 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 and um, sorry excuse I'm sorry for my uh, language here but uh, I just had to share it was so awkward and she was just like yeah. <laughs> wow, they even have a fake lake uh, pond in here. Oh, that's nice. I'm just filming the food, but I have no idea what it is. Oh, I love there is a little sign for international friends here. <laughs> saying hello to the chicken here. Just walking towards the Forbidden City now. So, I don't know if you guys remember, but me and Shaolin, we tried before to get into the Forbidden City, but we kind of gave up on it. And then another time I tried to go there on my own, but I gave up again because I was like, there are just too many tourists here. Um, but this time, because we're on this press trip, so we are of course going to the Forbidden City. So now you guys have the chance to actually see how it looks like inside I'm gonna show you all the beautiful rooms probably not all of them because there are a lot but I'll show you some of them anyways <laughs> So beautiful here, I'm so happy, so excited to show you guys how nice it is. Yay! So they're just setting up for some photography here, sea trip, they have their professional guy and we got Hash okay, here. make you guys do something. Hey Hash, Sorry. can you say hello? <laughs> You're coming here interrupting my, my video. So we have to write down our thoughts here about traditional Chinese medicine, um, put it on this very small amount of space 
Uh, Jax, how do you feel about it? How do you feel about it? I feel like you need to come up with a very good slogan very quickly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to sell lots of Chinese medicine. The sun is going down over the forbidden city here in Beijing. You can buy funny things here. Ah, uh, yeah, so I just got a new hat. I thought you would sh I would show you guys. Ah. How do you feel about it? How cool is this? <laughs> Princess look. After a long trip through the hectic traffic rush hour of Beijing, we have now arrived at this place called Tianxia Di Lou. Or maybe that's not oh no that's not the name. Anyways we're gonna go in and have some duck roasted duck. Wow this is real Beijing style. Lots of people sitting around the round table. 